In this video, we will look at a few examples to practice working with surface area and volume of similar solids. In example A, it asks, are the two rectangular prisms similar? How do you know? So the two rectangular prisms will be similar if all of their corresponding sides, like 4 and 6, or 3 and 4.5, or 5 and 7.5, are in the same ratio. So we should test all three ratios to see if they reduce to the same number, to see if the ratios are equivalent. So we'll test 6 over 4 and see what that equals and compare it to 4.5 over 3. And finally, compare that to 7.5 over 5. Now, if you change all of these to decimals, you find that they all equal 1.5. So that means all these ratios are equivalent. And because all the corresponding sides are in the same ratio, you can say, yes, these two rectangular prisms are similar. In example B, it says two similar cylinders are below. If the ratio of the areas is 16 to 25, what is the height of the taller cylinder? So we're given a ratio of areas, and we're looking at heights, which are a linear measurement. So we need to work backwards from the area ratio to the linear sort of scale factor, or the ratio between any two linear measurements. And the way we do that is we take the 16 over 25 area ratio and square root it. Because remember that the area ratio is always the scale factor squared. So that means our scale factor or our ratio between any two corresponding sides must be 4 to 5. So that means that the ratio of the two heights also must be 4 to 5 because that's a linear measurement. So we can set up a proportional equation that the ratio of 24 to h, which is the smaller height to the bigger height, must equal 4 over 5. And then we can solve this for h by cross-multiplying we end up getting 4h equals 120, which means that h equals 30. So the height of the taller cylinder is 30 units. In example C, it says two spheres have radii in a ratio of 3 to 4. What is the ratio of their volumes? So a radius is a linear measurement, so this really means that the scale factor is 3 over 4, which means that the area ratio would be 3 over 4 squared, and the volume ratio, which is what the question is asking about, would be 3 over 4 cubed, or 27 over 64. So the volume ratio is just the scale factor, or any linear measurement ratio cubed, so in this case, it's 27 over 64.